armored vehicles set to accompany the governor of the southwest region, Bernard Okalia Bilai, as he starts a tour of schools to evaluate the start of the new academic year. Southwest governor made stopovers at mostly boarding institutions within his zone of jurisdiction, amongst them the Presbyterian Comprehensive Secondary School, Baptist High School, and Bishop Rogan College of Small Sopo in Boya. At each stop, the governor left a similar message. We are showing them that uh, the authorities, the process of law, and the entire population is behind it. It should continue because uh, the school has so far too much here. We have uh, committed ourselves. We have decided that no more trouble within the campus. No more threat against schools. Before the governor's inspection, Boya woke up with quietness as most streets were ghosted and void of movement. In Kumba, the senior divisional officer was shocked to see just three students at Cameroon College of Arts and Science, Cass Kumba, with some teachers also absent on day one of back to school. The ex deal left instructions. The names and marketing numbers of all the teachers. All of them, which is in the middle of the town, is the blessing of Almighty God. But if you are here to disgrace the hierarchy, you know the good. Let me go down this to remove teachers from Molek from a teacher. Meanwhile, in primary schools, five pupils answered present with some classes having no pupils as they boycotted the start of the new school year for the fear of the unknown. I'm appealing to all the parents to, to send their children to school, that all the children should leave their houses and go back to school. We have started and we are not turning back. The teachers are already set. The town of Kumba was also void of movement as most commissioned motorcycle riders and car owners stayed indoors, causing a teacher who had trekked for a long distance to receive prayers from another colleague after suffering from a malaise.